Hey everyone, this is Derek J. Freeman uh, with uh, LiveFreeOrDance.com. I'm reporting to you here from my office at the Adam vs. The Man Studios. There's not much for me to show you right now, so I'm just going to give you this blank wall right here. Ideally, in the future, I'll have a banner to put up uh, for these types of videos, but I don't have anything right now, so hopefully my face is enough. I have an interesting video for you today. I made this Twitter uh, feed yesterday, or two days ago, when I was traveling into Mordor, Washington DC from the Shire uh, up in New Hampshire, and it said, arriving in DC three hours late, whoops, thanks for the monopolistic taxpayer subsidied faulty and unfriendly service of Amtrak, government. And when I wrote Amtrak, I said, why don't I just put that at symbol in front of their name? They probably have a Twitter account, and so I'll probably personally be sending this uh, message towards them. I'll, I'll be, like, tagging them in it. Pretty new to Twitter, so, uh, you know, I wasn't sure. But they actually got it and wrote back. Uh, they wrote, and I'll, I'll put a little uh, box up here, up on the screen, uh, so you can read along. But they say at Derek J. Freeman, my Twitter account. We're sorry about that. Please call customer relations at 1-800-USA-RAIL, 7 a.m. to 10 p.m., Monday through Friday, Eastern Time, or write at Amtrak.com slash contact us. Which is great. I think that's awesome. Uh, you know, at least someone at the uh, customer relations department is working, because I had really unfriendly service the day I was traveling in, and that was Tuesday, September 18th. I was on train 55 from Brattleboro, Vermont, down to DC. Now, I'm going to take them up on their offer uh, to call and speak with customer service, and I want to see where that gets me and uh, what, what can happen with this. So I'm going to give them a call now. Let's see, 1-800-USA-RAIL. And uh, let's put it on speaker, so you can hear. Hi, I'm Julie, Amtrak's automated agent. To check if a particular train is running on time, the train status, or to get schedule and price information, say schedule. For new or existing reservations, say reservation. You can also say it's something else. Can I continue at any time? It's something else. Sorry, please say introduction, train status, schedule, reservation, or say it's something else. It's something else. I can help you with this to get you the right information. Sorry, I didn't understand. Sorry, I still didn't understand. Please say existing reservations or press 1, baggage policy or press 2. Passenger services, or press 3, or say none of those, or press 4. I would like to speak with a customer service representative. I think you said you want to talk to an agent, is that correct? That is correct. Okay, I'll transfer you to an Amtrak agent. Your call may be recorded to ensure quality. Hold on. If for some reason your plans change and you are unable to I'm glad to that travel, worked. It doesn't always work when uh, the automated message the person gives you the options. They don't always say call. to uh, just say you want an agent. Sometimes that works. So. All of our reservation sales agents are currently assisting other customers. Your call is very important to us. Please hold and your call will be answered if the order was received. Thank you. Well. Looks like I'll be waiting. I'll speed up this part of the video for you in post. Are you wondering how an e-ticket differs from the conventional paper value tickets you used before? Nope. Your new e-ticket may be printed anywhere, home, work, or a hotel business center. Your PDF e-ticket will have the phrases e-ticket and present this document for travel in the upper right hand corner. Tickets from QuickTrack or from a ticket agent will have the phrase e-ticket travel document at the bottom of the e-ticket and in the fare box. Amtrak 
Hi, can you speak up, please? Hi, my name is Derek, and I'm recording this call for my records. I had a bad experience with um, an Amtrak train recently, and I tweeted about it, and Amtrak tweeted back to me saying I should call customer relations. So that's what I'm doing, and uh, I wanted to see if it's possible to get a refund. I was uh, extremely delayed and disappointed with the customer service on train 55, Tuesday, September 18th, uh, from Brattleboro to uh, DC. And uh, I just wanted to see if I could speak with someone about it. No, I'm going to finish your customer relations. Hold on. Thank you, sir. Okay, he was very quiet. I mean, the phone is on speaker, and you heard the difference between that automated message and his voice. All of our customer relations agents are currently assisting other customers. Your call is very important to us. Please hold, and your call will be answered in the order it was received. Thank you. All of our agents are still assisting other customers. We appreciate your patience. All of our agents are still assisting other customers. We appreciate your patience.
agents are still assisting other customers. We appreciate your patience. Okay, I've been on the phone now about 10 minutes, just wanted to give you viewers the update because I'm likely speeding through this video. I don't imagine many viewers are going to sit through and watch the whole thing as I sit here and wait on the phone for customer service. All of our agents are still assisting other customers. We appreciate your patience. So if my timing of this customer service lady's repeated remarks is uh, worth anything, she'll be giving me another update soon about how all of her customer representatives are busy assisting other customers. Much to my surprise. All of our agents are still assisting other customers. We appreciate your patience. Well, I was going to say I was wrong, but I guess not. Man, my hand is getting tired of holding this phone here. It's uh, been almost 15 minutes.
are still assisting other customers. We appreciate your patience. All of our agents are still assisting other customers. We appreciate your patience. Okay, now I've been waiting 16 minutes. It's roughly noon on Wednesday, September 20th.
customers. We appreciate your patience. Hi, yes, Melvin. My name's Derek, and I am recording this call for my records. I just want you to know. Um, I was recommended to call you at Amtrak Services um, after a Twitter, uh, after a tweet that I made uh, that I had a very unpleasant experience on an Amtrak train this Tuesday, uh, September 18th, on train 55 from Brattleboro to DC. Um, I don't know if you got other complaints, I'm sure you did, uh, that it was three hours late uh, in arriving at DC from um, Vermont, and it only started off about like 10 minutes late or something, which is, you know, that's understandable, I don't mind if a train's 10 minutes late, but arriving three hours late after breaking down several times and having the motor switched out is just unreasonable and uh, the ride that I had arranged um, was not able to pick me up. The difference between 10.15 p.m. and uh, what was it, 1.15 a.m. is a huge difference and uh, for an individual to have to sacrifice their sleep and their next day at work in order to be able to you know get a ride from there, it's, it's really unreasonable. So. Um, I'm just looking to see how this can be remedied. Do, do okay. you, can you offer some sort of remedy? I'll be more than happy to take a look at it and want to apologize for the delay. Um, what was your reservation number? Um, my reservation number, where would I find that? I have my computer here, I can look that up for you. Um, I mean, it will be on the email that was sent to you that you received from Amtrak. Okay, can you wait one moment while I look that up? Thank you. Just a moment. Okay. In, in the meantime, can I get your last name again, please? Yes. My name is Derek J. Horton. So last name is Horton? 
Yes, H O R T O N. Is it Derek? Yes. D E R R I C K. And I used my middle initial J. I'm not sure what address I used when I um, booked the reservation, okay. um, but I may have used 75 Leverett Street, Keene, New Hampshire. 75. Leverett Street, that's L-E-V-E-R-E-T-T. -E -E -T. Okay, I have my reservation number. Okay, that number is? 289624. Okay, thank you. Yes. 